Hey, so today I am going to show you how to make these amazing protein almond butter balls. Yes, and you're only going to use seven ingredients. Do you like the almond butter balls? I love the almond butter balls. Do your clients love the almond butter balls? Very few of them have had a chance to try it because I usually eat them before I get a chance to give them any. And that's true. Because and they hear about it too, so I know. Uh, when you see this video, you'll be like, where are my protein balls? Okay, so what we're gonna use, one cup of dried oats, two thirds cup of toasted coconut flakes, one heaping scoop of whey protein, and we use the vanilla flavor, one third cup of the chia and flaxseed blend, and then we have crunchy almond butter, and that is one cup of crunchy almond butter, and then we have half a cup to maybe two thirds cup of honey. And lastly, one cup of milk chocolate chips. Now, what you wanna do is you wanna start with your dry ingredients. So I'm gonna add oatmeal in. I'm going to add the toasted coconut flakes. I'm gonna add vanilla protein powder and then the chia flaxseed blend. Now I do this because I have done it where I've just dumped everything in at one time and I will say it does not mix very well. So So it's better to, to mix all the dry ingredients in first and mix yeah, them good. Yeah. Make sure everything's mixed well. And then you add in your fun sticky ingredients. So this is your crunchy protein. Crunchy almond butter. Yeah. Crunchy almond butter. Crunchy, Crunchy almond protein. <laughs> it does have protein yeah, in it, does. right? Yes. Yeah. So you start mixing it and then you're gonna add your honey in. Now I will say you can only mix so much with the spoon and eventually you're gonna have to get your hands dirty. So make sure you wash your hands first. <laughs> yeah, that's that's very important. Clean hands are better. So you want to kind of feel the texture. You want it to be a little sticky, a little, and I think I'm going to let you dump the chocolate chips in. My hands are a little sticky. And once you have it all mixed together, you're going to just pat it down and then we're going to cover it up and we're going to put it in the refrigerator for about 30 minutes to an hour. And then we will roll them into some beautiful little one inch mouth watering balls. Mouth watering balls? <laughs> Hey, they are tasty though. <laughs> Have to try them. They are. Okay, I believe it is that time. I'm gonna check on the spin. About 45 minutes. I believe they're ready. Awesome. Yeah, they're nice and cold. So I get a spoon and I just roll them into a nice little ball. All right, here it is. Ta da! They're done. done. And mm. how are they? Amazing? Delicious. <laughs> Good. Okay, so again, look below. You'll see the recipe and the macro breakdown.